Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be kitting up this lovely diamond painting of some flamingos. As soon as I saw this when I unboxed it, I thought it was just really, really pretty. I hope it turns out as nice as it kind of looks. Um, they don't always translate over to diamond paintings, especially with these smaller canvases. So it's a 30 by 40, but um, I think it's probably actually near like 25 by 35. I haven't got my tape measure with me. Mm. Anyway, we'll measure it on the completion review. But yeah, this is what I'm going to do. It's from Everyday E Deals. It was kind of gifted to me. Um, yeah, and it was four ninety nine. dollars It's still available on their website now if you want to go get it. So yeah, I've not done a kitting up video before, so <laughs> we'll see how it goes. Um, I don't even know if I've got much to chat about really, but I've got my little tub here. I've already stuck my stickers on um, ahead of time. There's 20 colours, which means I've got eight spares, but this looks a bit of a dodge one. So hopefully I won't need to use that for any spare drills. Um, I can switch it out if I, if I do really. Um, I've got some spare stickers just in case I need any of the extras. And then, um, yeah, we'll just get on, shall we? Um, let's see how we go. So what have you all been up to? Anything exciting? Um, I'm on my week's annual leave at the moment. So now, oh, is it gonna go? I think these are gonna be really tight. I'm wondering if I need one of my other storage thingies, which would be about right since I've stuck these stickers on. It might go in. That's one. Okay, we'll see. Hopefully they'll go. We'll see how we go. And if we end up having to change storage things, we will do. I'll just fit in. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know what happened then. My phone went off. Um, so we're only up to number seven. Um, you've not missed much. <laughs> um, we're all going in okay so far. So I thought this might be interesting as well because um, I've got my mum into diamond painting. She's finished a couple now and I, I kitted one up for her last night and took it round. Um, a Santa Claus one. So she thinks it might take her a little while and she really wants to have it done for Christmas. So she's got started with that. But I don't think she really knew about kitting up and she was working from like the little bags and then popping them in the like little um, baggies that you get sometimes with the kits, which are fine, but it's kind of like a bit easier just to, to work from something a bit more robust, I think. I just find it easier kitting up and I know it takes a little bit of time, but I think it's, it's worth that time. Now, this is a bit of an extra one here. So I'm just going to pop this spare one here, which is number eight. I should say it was seven, four, one. I'll just put that as a little spare and then we can top it up. Once we, um, sorry, I've just written it on here. I just realised I'm not even in shot. <laughs> sorry, guys. Um, just start having my spares at the at the back side of it all. Yeah, so like my mum didn't realise about kitting up, and um, I also sort of sectioned off um, the plastic covering with some washi tape, so she could just do small sections at a time, and um, rather than feeling daunted by the whole thing, and then she could just choose like a little area to work on. So I think she found that quite useful. Oops, that goes back there. Here we go. So number nine, just double checking. Seven four two. This looks like a lot here as well. I think a few of them have got quite a lot in. It's obviously all the background colours. I wish I should have. I was going to do a different um thing to kit up in, and I should have done that actually because it's quite a lot with large amounts of drills. But these are really easy to use. I quite like these. This size. However, I don't think it's adequate for what I'm doing today. 
but it doesn't matter. Um, so this one is 742. Um, and it's fine. As long as we don't need more than what we've, we've got. starting to come out really warm again i do need to get down to the allotment <laughs> um but i think i'll go tomorrow um yeah i think i'll go down tomorrow morning i'm really enjoying getting down there i mean i'm enjoying my crafting i seem to be just finding a bit more time for myself i think sometimes you need to be a little bit selfish don't you and just allow time for your hobbies and your interests is this one going to go in is it going to go in? I'm going to try. This might be a big fat fail. Oh, will that fasten? Oh, it does just. <laughs> that was close. Um, so, yeah, I think it's really important just to find time for yourself and then um, make a bit of time out your day to do something that you enjoy. Um, especially when we're also busy, either like work, your home, family, um, other commitments and things that you may have. So yeah, I'm starting to be a bit more selfish and I'm feeling much happier for it. <laughs> um, right, where are we up to now? 815, which is 12. Just need to make sure, because I've taken off the numbers, like like the, the key down the side, down 1 to 20. Just making sure I put the correct drills in the correct symbol, otherwise that would be a disaster. So let me know, um, maybe in future, I might start getting some questions and things that we can talk about <laughs> um, when I'm kitting up. Or maybe I can just speed through it all, perhaps. And that might be something useful as well. Let me know if you want to have like a, a run through like this, just as I'm doing it, like with the, me just rambling on about nothing in particular. Or if you'd like a more structured thing, or just like a little fast forward with a bit of music. Or if you don't really care, and you're not bothered about even seeing it at all. <laughs> um, my channel is so varied, it isn't just diamond painting, as lots of you know. Um, it kind of reflects my life, I suppose, really, and, and my interests. So I have, obviously, like, crafty things. I've got my beauty stuff. I've got allotment things. It is literally just an extension of myself, which I suppose, which is what it should be. I had considered... Um, having a different channel like sort of one for beauty one for crap I thought well that's just too much hard work to maintain and plus I've worked really hard at getting the amount of subscribers I've got and um and it takes time and you can't just get that overnight and people don't have to click on the video so if somebody's interested in just my beauty boxes they don't need to watch the craft things but then if someone's just interested in the craft things they don't need to watch the beauty things um yeah, and I think that's sort of the way to go. But quite a lot of people, particularly that have watched my beauty box unboxings, have are really sort of interested in my gardening vlogs and also in these crafty ones. And a few have started to do diamond painting, which is awesome. Right, well, these go in. Oh, this is going to be really tight. I think there's too many. <laughs> this is like me trying to fit into my jeans. Uh, right, yeah, I definitely need to... Um, <laughs> have a bit of spillovers might as well make that nice and roomy in there um which number was this so it's 12 15 so 15 yeah which is nine three eight um yeah definitely me trying to squeeze into my jeans <laughs> oh, get in there squeeze in <laughs> nine three eight oh dear Okay, so how many of you that are watching this video now with diamond paint? Also, what channels do you like watching? Um, who have I been watching? So obviously, as you know, I've mentioned before, Joan Diamond Paints. I really like watching her. There's also, I've started watching Diamond, paint, diamond Painting Anonymous or Diamond Painters Anonymous. Um, oh, there's a few others as well. But Diamonds and Washy, 
there and then she does quite a few challenges and it's a challenge that I'm, I'm really interested to do challenges and um, back in the day when i used to do my card making um i used to do a lot of like challenge blogs and things and then um, i was on like design teams for all the different challenge blogs and that was really good i'm just distracted now where i'm up to 961 <laughs> um i used to really really enjoy that so i'm quite interested to see if there are any diamond painting challenges so if you know of any let me know because i'd be really interested to do that and it's a nice way of um sort of focusing you on like completing your projects or maybe helping you select what to do next because sometimes you've got all these diamond paintings and i'm really lucky i get sent a lot in pr and it's like well which one do i do next so yeah unless it's something i really want to do like this as, as soon as i saw this coming guys i just really wanted to do it um so yeah i think there's gonna be i think i saw someone saying something there's like a 30 by 30 challenge coming up um i can't remember where that was and then i think it's also like an october one um is it diamonds and chill i think is it diamonds and chill something like that where you do like halloweeny projects so that looks quite interesting i don't even need to go sign up for that but other than that i don't know do they have like regular like weekly things or monthly things i think maybe instagram might be the place to go searching it's just knowing the people who to follow um you know stuff like that it's it's a little bit tricky when you're sort of fairly new in a particular craft isn't it sort of where everyone goes for inspiration so yeah well I like this lime color so we're nearly done guys literally we're on the last colors it wasn't so bad we've only got three overflows so actually it was a pretty good size thing to use after all now you don't have to do this but i prefer to do this and i find it easier to work from and then um, yeah that's me all kitted up with loads of rubbish bags everywhere so there's all my drills all in so these are the 20 and i've got these three as overflow which is fine so once i might be wearing from these first off and then that'll be that um so what do we need to fill in here so there are 20 colors there are 20 rounds we don't have any squares ab's crystals or special drills um and i've kitted up on what day is it today I don't even know what date it is. I will write today's date in there <laughs> once I've done it. And then, yeah, that's it. So I'm really excited. I'm going to finish this video so that I can go and get a little bit done um, before it's time for tea tonight, for dinner. So, yeah, I'm excited about that. So I hope that was kind of useful. It was really quick. I know a lot of people do when they kit up. They might do a few at once, but I'm just happy doing one at a time working on that i've ordered my baggies to start organizing my spare drills storage so that might be a video that i'll do in the future um because i've got bits of things like this all over the place that now just need sorting out and storing and um yeah exciting to sort of like try and get organized like that so i hope you found this useful um if you haven't i'm sorry <laughs> if you found it dull i'm sorry but that's just basically what kitting up is and then um, i just think it's sometimes handy just to see another way to maybe prepare for your diamond painting so take care guys enjoy the rest of your day i'll see you all later Mwah! bye for now